What's up guys, welcome back. If you saw my toy hunting video, you know I got Studio Show's Rhinox. Let's go. So, let's open him up. Let's open him up. Trusty scissors. Done. Okay. If we open up. It always bends for mine, I don't know. I don't know, like, I don't know why it does it. Tell me what happens with yours. Can't do that. Here, oh, well, his hammer already fell out. That was very secure. Here is Rhinox. First, first thoughts. He actually does look like a brilliant figure. Hang on, I thought Hasbro said they were gonna do plastic-free packaging. This isn't very plastic-free to me. This doesn't look very plastic free because it looks very plastic prone um anyways um let me just clean this all up okay here is rhinox out the packaging he's very nice oh first for rhinox this is the first time rhinox has not had the rhino head on the back looks very nice actually nice from a side perspective he's very accurate to the movie actually okay let's check out his hammer it's a nice hammer i wonder like what i wonder what those are, are they just like spikes or are they like bullets hammer's got very nice detail especially on here you see all that nice detail Ooh, that is nice. Some nice detail up here. Looks like, like actually, it looks it looks like a rhino. Then these like spikes, bullet things. I don't know. And then here's Rhinox. He's quite big. He's yeah, he's he's quite big. He looks big. Side perspective. Other side. Back. Looks very nice. Okay. Let's bring in some comparisons. I, I didn't do this in my options plan video, but there will be a second part. Don't worry. Okay, let me just make sure. Skirt is quite a bit taller. Okay, now let's bring in Battle Trap. Rhinox is bigger. Now, one sec. I do have Cheetor, but he is currently on a display in his Cheetor mode, so yeah. Um, Bumblebee. See this? Rhinox is quite a bit bigger and also the one that i have actually done a review on already studio series optimus prime i believe he's smaller yes he is he is indeed smaller only a little bit though so yeah i i overall thoughts thoughts i love the figure i think it's absolutely amazing If you have a pick between, I mean, if you if you have a pick between him and Cheetor, definitely go Rhinox. Well, it depends if you're like a Cheetor fan, then go Cheetor. But I would recommend Rhinox. He's quite a good figure. And he's got a lot of battle damage. Nice battle damage there. Look at that. Oh, that is amazing. Do you know what he reminds me of? He reminds me of the um, knights from Transformers Last Night. Very reminiscent to them. Anyways, thanks for watching. Make sure you like, subscribe, and ring the bell.